Mark here from JBBG. Let's take a look at the CA90 from Classic Army. Um, quality bit of kit, lots and lots of extras on it. When you get it, please do read through the manual you get with it. Here's the manual here. It's quite a thick manual. There is so much to this gun. There is a lot of information in here. Right the way through to the red dot, um, the loading, it's got a lot to it. So please do read through the manual. You also get one of these dust bags with this particular gun. Um, I haven't put that on the website because I'm not sure every single one does come with it. Just this, this last uh, batch we've got in has, has them. So uh, you may, you may not get it, or you should do. Um, so let's release the mag. So you pull these clips back just down here and take the mag out. Now the magazine, to load the magazine, you've got a little spring here that you pull back. So you just pull that spring all the way back and then this little window door here that you just pull up, that also holds the spring back in place and you pull your BBs into there. You just pull them in, fill them up, pull the spring back a bit, drop the um, door and that's it. And then you charge it by winding here. So you wind and wind this up. So you see the BBs appear here and give it a few, good few winds. And then you just simply slot that in and push down and that's in there. Selector switch is just at the bottom of the trigger here. If you can see that, you can just adjust that. So single shot, um, yeah. Safety, single shot and full auto. Your battery goes in the back here. Now this, these quality guns, just push the button at the bottom here and that releases it. These quality guns, you know, please do use uh, LiPos. Um, you spend a lot of money on the gun, so spend a bit of money on the battery and charger and it will really perform for you. Now these, all these um, Classic Armies come with these little safety chips now which basically look after the internals of your gun. If you try and uh, fire the gun four times with a, a battery that's low power, that's not going to power the gun, that will um, basically disable the gun so what will happen is you only way to free that up is to put a fully charged battery back in it and then it will start working again so this has a red dot sight at the top here uh, the switch is underneath here you just put your finger underneath here and switch it so you can switch it on and off um, batteries go in the front here just drops down this uh, tells you how to do that on the actual manual you get this little tool with it as well with an allen key basically this adjusts it so to adjust it vertically up and down you put it in here if you can see that you line that up where is it there it is line it up and then you put an allen key in this part loosen it adjust it and tighten that up again and the same with like left and right the so horizontal and vertical and you just put that in there again undo that adjust it and tighten it back up so that comes with the actual gun um, yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful bit of kit, just looking over it now. So take a look, that is on the website now. Charging handle. Hop up, I believe the hop up. Is there, yes it is. Just there, you pull it back, there's the hop up there, you can adjust that and then close that up again so the hop up's there. As I say, there's lots of little bits and pieces all over this gun, read the manual. There's stuff that I probably haven't seen at the moment. So uh, yeah, do have a look at the manual. That is on the website now. Please do take a look. Thanks for watching.